Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. So, I wanted to make a what's in my bag video for my Louis Vuitton Neverfull in the GM size. I went with monogram print. This is an older bag, as you can tell by the inside lining here. Um, I purchased this bag pre-loved and it's been with me now for about two years and uh, maybe just a little bit over two years. I have another video I'll link. It's the first video I did on this bag, kind of going into more detail about it and its history. But I have some cool stuff in here, my usual things that I will carry in this bag or day to day for myself and for my kids. And I thought it'd be fun to just, uh, you know, go through it with you. You can see it has a very nice honey patina. Um, it being, I want to say this bag was from like before 2000, but I'd have to go back and check the tag and check my notes on my other video just to be 100% sure. Um, but I have an insert in here from Smorga. I try to put inserts in all of my bags, especially my two Neverfulls, because it helps protect it. It helps keep things organized so things aren't just floating around here like a bottomless pit. Um, keep in mind, because this is the larger bag of the Neverfulls, um, it can get really heavy really quick. I have this little tag on here for now, but I'm not sure how I feel about it. I was hoping it would patina a little bit quicker, but it has. It's just taking a, a while to match the bag. I know these um, little handles, you can use them, or these straps to cinch the bag. I've seen them clipped up on the top. But let's get in here and I can start showing you what I usually carry in my bag. So, a little backstory. I did purchase a new GM Neverfull. And I had all this stuff in there. And then I decided, you know what? I'm just going to stick with this old one that I have. It gets the job done. It holds everything. Like, why do I need two GMs right now? So I returned it and I actually purchased um, another bag that I'll be showing you guys. So this is my toiletry 15. I have all three in the 15, 19, and the 26. Right now I'm just using it to carry some lip products. This is a liner from Makeup Forever two MAC lipsticks that I like to mix together. Um, I believe one of the colors is Blinkety and the other is Pink Plaid. And then this is a Dior Balm. It's just the clear. It's not, it doesn't have color to it. And then this is Chanel, the same thing. It's the clear, I'll show you here. This is a really nice moisturizer on the lips. I don't like to wear lipstick around my kids because I give them lots of kisses, so. I just keep that in here and I'll moisturize. And then in here I have a Samorga insert, you can see. And it's the Samorga that has the D-rings because sometimes I'll put my little pearl um, handle on here also from Samorga and use this for like a date night or if I have like a little wedding or graduation to go to and I just need to carry a tiny bit of things, I'll put the strap on here. So I have that. And you know what? Maybe for now I'll just put the things on the outside as I go through them. This is the pouch that came with my Damiera Bean uh, Never Fool, the MM and Rose Ballerine. I'm just using it for feminine products. My friend um, gave me the idea to do this. This is a all-purpose body wipe and I got this idea from a YouTuber. She carries these little disposable bags. I got a big old pack for cheap on Amazon. And you can just put all of your towels, wipes, dirty things in there and then just toss it all. Especially if some restrooms you go to don't have a like sanitary napkin or um, the little trash can next to the toilet. You can just walk out with it and dump it if you had to. I always carry my Kindle with me in my work bag and in my purse because I like to read. Um, any opportunity I get to catch up on books or study my Bible, I have my Bible on my Kindle. It's the message version. And right now I'm reading this amazing book called The Power of a Praying Wife. It's my third time reading it. It's such a good book. I highly recommend it. So some diapering stuff, nothing fancy there, just some diapers and wipes. And let's see what else. So this is my Sarah wallet. 
and it was one of the very first items I purchased brand new from the store about four years ago, actually more than four years ago, probably like closer to five years ago. And I put these little cash dividers in here from the planner spot so that if I'm carrying cash in this wallet or I just need to set aside cash or we're traveling, usually I'll use it when we're traveling and I'll have cash for things here and like our insurance cards and um, gift cards, other things where I need to carry a, a, a big bulk of things, not just, you know, my driver's license. This is the only wallet I have right now that's an actual size wallet and I really love it. I did a video going detail into this wallet so I'll link that down below for you and also showing how I made the cash dividers that way if you're interested in seeing that whole setup. So let me see what to show you next. You can probably see I mean these little pockets come in, in handy to divide everything. So right now I'm kind of in between both of these lotions. They're my favorite hand lotions. The Lemire is a little thicker. So as it gets drier, this is great. My hands don't chap or peel. I love this. I only apply it maybe once a day and it gets the job done. And then I just started trying this one, the Chanel cream. What I love about this is that it has a little spout on the top but it doesn't come out unless you squeeze it. So it's kind of like double protection in your purse that the lotion's not gonna, it's gonna spew out everywhere. But it works really well. And then I have my little um, key holder, six ring key holder. It's really hard to put like big keys in here. Sometimes I just leave it out like this and I have my mailbox key and a house key. But it's so pretty and it's such a classic little piece so I purchased this brand new um, from the store several years ago and let's see my little coin pouch it's empty right now but it's so pretty I wanted to include it in my purse I went for a ride today because there's nothing in here I recently got this little insert from Samorga in the thinnest felt that she offers it in. And look, it's so cute. It's tiny and it fits it perfectly so that it can protect it. That way, if I want to put coins in here, um, I don't have to worry that they're going to scuff up the inside of my little pouch. But isn't it cute? I love that it has the large monogram. And then on the back side here, it has the little mini monogram. It's just so cute. This was my newest little guy. It is the smallest of the agendas, the PM size or the pocket. Um, and I love it. I'm in it right now. I have another video I'll link down below where I kind of do a little mini flip through of this. And then I just recently did a video showing my entire a bean collection of all the agendas because I'm that crazy planner lady. And this is the little Rosalie. It's a little card holder and it has a zipper pouch where you can put coins or cash, whatever you want. I had a little heart put on it. Um, when I purchased this, I got it pre-loved, but it was for um, a gift for my husband and my kids. And so I put that little heart on there. It reminds me of them every time I see it. Right now I have coins. I should probably put this in my little coin pouch. Um, I'll probably just empty them to be honest, but you can store that in there. That's cute. I'm kind of like uh, using this in the fall because of the pink. Like I feel like pink in the fall just isn't like your typical fall season color, but it, it gets the job done. Here are my newest beauties. Um, I purchased these in the summertime from a Facebook seller. She has a great little shop on Facebook and I'll try to link it down below for you guys. And she carries designer sunglasses. Like they are legit authentic sunglasses. Maybe they're like the season prior or an older style. So she has them for a discounted price. Um, these are my only and my first pair of Gucci sunglasses. Um, my friend has these and I tried them on and I really love them. They were lightweight. They cover everything. I love that they have a little bit of a cat eye look to them. And one of my favorite parts, let me show you, is the gold little bee. 
look at how cute it is just this tiny little gold bee um, emblem and the Gucci is not really like in your face Gucci it's just a tiny little um, emblem there on the, the corners of the sunglasses and they come in this very very beautiful red case which is just gorgeous I can't wait to use this um, with my holiday stuff or just around the holidays that nice red reminds me of Santa um, I have a scrunchie here for my daughter if I need to put her hair up. I'm just going to put it in my pouch. I usually don't like things floating around and I can't find them when I need them. Or if I switch bags, I'll leave it behind. I also carry um, a couple little essentials here. Um, if you're interested in this little case, it's amazing. If it's in all my bags, I got it on Amazon for cheap. It's like six bucks. Has these big old pockets, little pockets. I have it holding supplements and vitamins. And sometimes I keep like little dental sticks in that, um, or flossing sticks in this bigger pocket. But it, it, it fits. It fits everything. And I think it's so cute. It's perfect for travel. So the dental sticks can fit in here. Oh, my hand is so dry. I should have put some of that lotion on before I started filming. <laughs> and here is the hand sanitizer that I actually learned about this hand sanitizer from Amber Ashley because it's refillable. Look at that. So you take the top off and this little plastic thing comes off and then you just refill it with the refill bag and pop your lid back on and there's your hand sanitizer. And it's nice and flat. Um, if it's in all your bags, it looks pretty. It smells like lavender. Here is my travel size Chanel Chance. And I purchased this perfume for the first time last year, and I've been really enjoying it. But I do get the travel. I'm going to probably start buying all my perfumes in travel just to make sure that I'm using them. Because if not, I probably won't wear them. And so I'm just going to start putting everything back in here. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I know I don't have like a ton of stuff in here, but these are all of my essentials and I reach for these items every day, all the time. When I'm carrying this bigger bag, I can put sweatshirts in here right on top of my things or a blanket if I need to. Um, sometimes I'll carry some extra little things that I might need. Um, if I need to carry one of my agendas with me, my bigger one, I know it's going to fit in here. I use this bag a lot, um, like to go to church or if I'm going to be out for a long time with my kids because it holds a lot. So if they have a toy, um, something that I just need to pop in here, I can carry it and I can have it hold other things other than mom's personal stuff or mom's, um, things and I'll sometimes double up the pockets like I did here. Right now I have this other pair of sunglasses, my Fendi's in here. I need to put them away. And there it is. Such a beautiful bag. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Until next time, bye. Have a wonderful day.